I love it here. I love America. I've never lived in a country before that advertises drugs on television. <laughs> yeah, one lady, one lady high as all hell right there. Just very openly proud. That's what's great about you guys. I grew up in countries with socialized medicine, grew up in Canada, and then lived in Britain. Illegal to advertise drugs on TV. Because it gets dangerous. Yeah, it makes people self-diagnose. Not here, you guys don't care. You're like watching the Big Bang Theory and in the second commercial break, some dude comes out and goes, hey, do you suffer from the human condition? Maybe you want some of these drugs we got. <laughs> Which is amazing, man. And now we've got an opioid crisis in this country and nobody can figure out why. <laughs> Maybe it's because we see them every night. You're all walking into your doctor. In Canada and Britain, Canada and Britain, you grow up and you're like, if you feel ill, go see your doctor. Here in America, you go tell your doctor. You go see your doctor, you go, hey doc, last night, me and the missus, we were watching This Is Us, and we thought, we don't cry enough. <laughs> Do you have something that can help us out? That's why Roseanne Barr sends out a racist tweet while on Ambien, and half of America went, that makes sense, that tracks. <laughs> She was on Ambien. Everybody's, you know, default position when you're on a sleeping drug is racism. <laughs> When's the last time one of your friends used that excuse on you? Dude, I'm sorry that I showed up to your picnic in blackface. <laughs> but in my defense, I was exhausted. 